Hey there, everybody. MST3K Forever here with some very important news. Um, may maybe not. Well, yeah, yeah, important news. Yeah, it's definitely gonna be important for you guys to be aware of this, I guess. Um, first of all, thank you everyone for your appreciation on the videos. I guess all of you really are seeing. You guys all really seem to like that Metal Gear Let's Play. Um, I was not expecting that to be nearly as well received. Um, as it was, but yeah. Yeah, you guys really seem to like that one. Um, so you can expect to definitely see me doing more Metal Gear, because I'm having a blast with it. Um, I've got some more projects in the work as well, uh, but that does kind of lead me to my big announcement. Um, this is a little bit of behind-the-scenes stuff, but, um, where I currently am, uh, I am not at all happy with where I am living right now. Um, and I do not have really the means to improve the situation that I'm in right now. So I have made the decision to simply leave. I am going to be moving at the end of April to a completely new city, a new state. I am traveling literally across the country to go where basically I want to be. I'm traveling to Minneapolis, and I am looking forward to that so much. I'm going there uh, not just to get away, but also because there are much better job opportunities for me there. I've got a, a possible really, really good job lined up for me over there if I can swing it. Uh, I've got a much better living condition. I've got a whole lot of great stuff, but it is by far the riskiest move that I have ever made in my life, and the biggest change that I have ever made. This is this is honestly bigger than when I joined the military, because the military, I mean, yes, it was the military, but you always had a sure paycheck, and you always were, you know, sure where you were going to go, um, even if it was the hostile environment, you, you know, but this is, this is just on me. I have no backup where I'm going, um, and this is basically my crash or fail moment. Uh, what this means for you is that I have, I'm gonna have to dedicate pretty much close to 100% of every single bit of effort I can into this project and keeping myself sane um, to do this. Because I have to study, I have to search for jobs, I have to search for better locate, I'm gonna search for apartments. Um, I, like I said, I got some other jobs lined up, but even if everything goes well, I'll still be without that better paying job for at least about two to three months. So I have to find some other stuff in the meantime, and unfortunately, Making YouTube videos does not bring in any real income. Uh, you got something on you guys, but I mean, it just doesn't. That, that's not gonna cut it. Um, so I'm gonna have to put a lot of effort into studying up for this new job, studying up so I can really make sure I get it, studying up for everything, because it's the biggest, just biggest, biggest change that my life is ever going to make. But I have to do it, because the current situation that I'm in is no good. And I, I have to make the decision to give myself a better... Well, the... Uh, just a better life. Now what does this mean for you guys? Well, not a whole lot. Um, I am going to keep doing the videos, because I love doing that, and seeing you guys loving the videos too, I just enjoy doing it. I really enjoy it. Um, I'm still going to do it. I still have a couple videos lined up for you, if I can get the damn things uploaded. Um, so you will see them, it's just... <sighs> Guys, I have tried so hard, so hard to do a consistent, everyday schedule with videos, and it keeps falling through, because it's just not possible with the internet that I have here. I mean, you guys have seen that video where I showed off how piss-poor it was. I, I can't... I can't do it. I just can't do it, and with the amount of time and effort that I'm going to have to pour into making sure that I'm going to be good for this move, I, I can't afford to plug as much time as I have been into this project, so you are going to be seeing a lot less videos. Maybe maybe three to four uploads a week, but that's probably going to be about it. Um, unless I can get... I'm probably going to be getting a lot of stuff together and then uploading everything that I have um, as I'm studying at a college or something, and then uh, you'll see a, a huge burst of videos and then a lot of silence. So, 
basically you're not going to see any real difference <laughs> in the upload schedule. <laughs> Except for the fact that I've kind of accepted that it has to be that way. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to see anything different. I just realized, oh fuck. The main point is that you guys will have your videos, but there's going to be a, a lot less of them because I'm going to be focusing on more important matters. But I haven't forgotten about you, I just have to do some things to make sure that I'll be able to keep doing videos in the future, basically. <laughs> However, that does actually lead me into the other thing that I wanted to talk about. I have officially launched a Patreon! Now, if you've been watching at the end of my videos, I'm sure you already know this, because that's the only way you could have known. Um, I meant to put up a formal video announcing this, but I just wanted to wait until I could make sure that I could be good on the promises that I wanted to make as far as rewards and everything goes, but that's just not going to happen. I just can't. I really, I would love to, but I can't. I was going to adhere to a strict video schedule with certain videos available for certain tiers of backers and all sorts of really cool stuff and live streams and all really great incentives, but there is no way I'm going to be able to do that in the near foreseeable future. Just not going to happen. But what I will do is I'm going to go back and by the time this video is up, you will, this will have happened. But I'm going to be reworking the Patreon page to where it's a bit more realistic. There's only going to be one level of goal, and that is going to be if you pledge a dollar, at minimum a dollar to me, on the Patreon, then you will have access to every single video when it is uploaded. All of them. Like, when I upload my stuff in batch, you guys will... most of it's going to be one video a day, but if you... If you subscribe to me on the Patreon, even for just a dollar, everything that I upload will also be available to you immediately. So you will see these huge explosions of spam when I upload my videos, and you will get like five or six parts of Metal Gear at a time, plus a bunch of other little minor videos that you may be not so interested in. Um, but that is what I'm going to offer, because that's what I'm going to be able to offer. So, and also, just so you know, um, Patreon, there was a big scare a while back concerning Patreon where they were going to change how the billing worked and you guys were going to get um, tacked on with that extra money because Patreon always has to take a little bit off the top for them. So you pledge a dollar and I get like 75 cents. Um, but that, they, everyone rejected that so badly, so whatever you pledge to me, that is what you pay. If you just pledge a dollar, I will get 75 cents, but you will just only, get, only be paying a dollar. Um, no worries there. If you want to pledge, pay, pledge $10, thank you so much. Um, you will only be charged for $10. Any amount, you were only pledged for that. And if you are already a member of Patreon, um, I'm sure you've already been sending out stuff to other people as well. You've already been pledging to other people. If you're not, it's a really great way to support your the creators and content producers that you love. And we are always usually pretty good about giving you back some kind of good incentives and rewards. For me, it's going to be early videos and polls and behind the scene access and voting. Um, one one that I will keep though is that if you do pledge at a certain level, I think I was left at like $25, you could actually pick a video, pick a game for me to do a video on. I had that incentive a long time ago, but it just I just didn't kick stick with it and it fell through. But if you don't want to want to pledge $25 a month or at least just $25 one month, you can have me play a game of your choosing for an hour. And, um, of course, I will, I do, I will do an, a full hour of footage, but I may edit it down if there's, like, dead bits in it, just to sort of shrink it down, so you may not get a full hour of content, but I will let's play the entire game for an hour. I'll just edit it down so it's palatable. Um, if you want to pledge at $50, I think it is, I will actually do a, a mini-series on a game, like three episodes. Now that probably won't be immediately, because I'm going to have to get the game, get it ready, and then find the time to record, but it will happen within at least two weeks, I guarantee you that, of you uh, pledging and the pledge going through. So, pledges get collected at the end of every month, so I'd say by the 15th of each month you'd see those coming up. Uh, earlier for Patreon supporters, of course, but yeah, yeah, I feel, like I feel confident I could do that. 
I actually did that once before with uh, Dracula 4 back in the day. Um, someone pledged to me, and then we did it that way. So, yeah, that's doable. But yeah, if you guys do want to pledge to me to help me out, because right now, I could really use the financial assistance. I can't promise you a lot, but I can promise you my absolute gratitude, access to the polls, access to whatever you want um, for me to play, you know, within reason, no, nothing that's going to appear on a red tube, but, um, you know, anything within reason, um, and then and whatever, whatever you, however you guys want to help, basically. Um, I'm opening up that option avenue. Do not feel like you are under any obligation to. I'm in a hard enough spot as is right now. I understand a lot of people are too. But if you guys feel like donating to me, even just a dollar does help out a lot. Getting this Patreon off the ground is the hardest part, but you can help with that. And if you can, awesome. If not, that's fine. Just enjoy the videos. Liking, favoriting, sharing those videos, that all helps out a lot too. It's indirect, but it still is just as helpful and I am just as grateful for it. You can also follow me on Twitter and like those as well. Every time I put up a video, there's always an accompanying tweet announcing it. Because, well, YouTube doesn't always let you know when those smaller channels post. So that Twitter is a great way to make sure you never miss a video. And liking and retweeting those is a really good way to raise awareness for my channel. But any way you can help out, whether it be directly through Patreon or just retweeting or sharing the videos, it's all very much appreciated. I'm so glad you guys all enjoy my videos, but right now this is really kind of my plea for help. This is going to be, bar none, one of the hardest times in my life, and any help I can get is greatly appreciated. So, thank you, just ahead of time, for everything. And, hey, like I said before, if you ever wanted to see me play a specific video game, now would be a great time to pledge at that $25 level and make me play it. Or do a miniseries on it at that $50 level if you can afford it. Just keep in mind that I won't be able to get to those videos immediately, but certainly within that following month, I will definitely get, do my absolute best to get them out, um, provided I have internet access at that time. <laughs> but, yeah, thank you guys all so much. I am really, really looking forward to this, even though I am kind of scared stiff about it. <laughs>